Hello viewers, today I'll show you how to make a delightful Italian recipe which uses baby squid and shrimp with long spaghetti from Napoli. The recipe is called baby squid and shrimp spaghetti. For this recipe, I'll be using 500 grams of this iconic pasta from Napoli, which is made by one of the oldest pasta companies in the world. You can use any good spaghetti for this recipe if you can't get hold of this. I'll also use some cleaned and gutted baby squid. These are raw, as you can see. and some cooked prawns or shrimps. You can use raw prawns as well for this dish. Approximately equal amounts of chopped carrots, celery, onions and one tablespoon of chopped garlic. Some chopped cherry tomatoes. A can of anchovies. 350 grams of crushed tomatoes. Some white wine vinegar some extra virgin olive oil and a bit of parmesan cheese. Heat some olive oil in a pot. Add the anchovies along with its oil in the pot and saute for half a minute. Then add the garlic into the pot and give the pot a stir then add the onions carrots and celery into the pot and fry them together for three to four minutes then add the chopped tomatoes into the pot and give them a stir Then add salt according to your taste and some black pepper. Mix them in. Then add a dash of white wine vinegar and mix it in. Then add the crushed tomatoes into the pot and mix it in. Then cover and cook on low flame for 10 minutes. Meanwhile, let's cook the pasta. Put some boiling water in a large stock pot. Let's open up our long spaghetti from Napoli. You can see that this is the godfather of spaghetti. See how long it is. Very good artisan product made from 100% durum wheat. Add some salt into the boiling water. Then put the long spaghetti into the pot. You can see that it is almost double the length of the normal spaghetti. Stand it upright and it will slowly sink in. Cook for 11 minutes. Let's check on our pasta sauce. It's done. Now it's time to add the raw baby squid in. If you are using raw prawns, then this is the time you add them in. Give the squid a stir and cover and cook for 6 to 8 minutes. Then remove the lid. Give them a stir. Then add the cooked prawns into the pot and let them warm through for a minute or two. Now it is time to add our long spaghetti into the sauce. Add a bit of the pasta water as well into the pot. Mix everything together. This will be a bit hard because the spaghetti is so long. Make sure that the pasta sauce coats the spaghetti really well. Crush some basil leaves in your hand. Tear them up and add them to the spaghetti. And a delicious baby squid and shrimp spaghetti is done. 
Let's plate up this yummy sp seafood spaghetti. Yum! Sprinkle some parmesan cheese on top and serve this wonderful pasta from Napoli. Doesn't it look absolutely beautiful? You can add the seafood of your choice to this dish to make it your very own. Hit the subscribe button for more. Enjoy!